Mandak means a frog that means position of a frog while doing this seat, hence it is called Durgakasan. This asana is also done in many ways. Here's the prevailing way. Method. First of all sitting in Pandasan, sit in Vajrasana and then close the fist of both hands. When closing the fist, press the thumb in the fingers. Then, putting both hands on both sides of the navel, breathing out in front of the breath, pulling the chin out on the ground. After staying in this situation for a while, come back to Vajrasana. Inverted seat. After doing every posture, do the opposite posture. After the Manduakasan, if you want to ask yoga teacher, you can do Yatrasaran or vice versa. Frequency. Practice of Dandukasan is done twice, but patients of diabetes can practice it for three to four times. Caution. If there is a serious stomach disease, do not post it. Do patients with slip discs, osteoporosis, and back pain patients by asking a yoga doctor. Keeping the asana in mind, keep in mind that the hand pages of both hands are well positioned around the navel. The benefits of this posture. Extremely beneficial for the stomach, this posture activates the pancreas, which in turn leads to diabetes patients. This seat is considered extremely beneficial for the abdomen and heart. This posture removes diseases like stomach disorders such as constipation, gas, seizures, loss of appetite, indigestion, digestion of food, etc. This posture has favorable effect on all the organs such as stomach, small intestine, large intestine, gallbladder, pancreatiasis, rectum, liver, reproductive organs and kidneys. It is said that Matsyendrasana was composed by Gorakhnath's master Swami Matsyendranath. They used to be meditating in this posture. Half Matsyendrasan was prevalent only on the half verse of Matsyendrasana. This verse reinforces the vertebra with the bones of the spine. Method. Both legs are raised long while sitting. Then, fold the left leg to the knee and place it under the heel's anus. Now turn the right leg from the knee and place it above the left leg's stomach and keep it on the ground behind the stomach. Now cross the left hand with the right leg knee, i.e. holding the knee right next to the left hand with the right thumb hold. Now move the right hand behind the back and hold the lower part of the left leg's thigh. Turn the head on the right side so that the chin and left shoulder come in a straight line. Do not bend downwards. Keep the chest tight. Caution. If there is any serious complication in the spinal cord and there is no serious illness in the stomach, then do not do this posture. Its benefits. Spermatozoosomia keeps the sperm from healthy. Nodes coming out of them with spinal cord also get good workout. They have a good effect on the back, stomach nodes, feet, neck, hands, waist, lower part of the navel and good strain of chest pneumo. As a result, the bondage is far away. Gastric intestines are intense. This posture is beneficial for chronic liver, spleen and inactive kidney. Pain of back, back and arthritis quickly disappears. Macrasin is counted on the backs of the abdomen and it is done in the rugs. In the last state of this posture, the shape of our body appears like a crocodile, hence it is called macrasin. This gives peace to the end of the motion of breath and ends peace. It feels peace by ending the barrier of breath. Caution! Both feet have so much difference that touch the land. Sina keeps up from the ground. Keep the head in the middle after making a shape like a scissor of both hands. Breathlessness is a natural condition. Benefit. Macrasin comes under comfortable rugs whenever it is done by laying on the belly. The speed of breathing increases. The practice of makarasin is used to bring the vision of that breathlessness into a natural state. With the practice of this asana, all vertebrae and muscles get relief. The blood flows smoothly in the body so that they are always healthy and healthy. 
The lungs spread in the position of this posture so that the oxygen inside them goes in excess and the contaminated air emerges. Therefore, it helps in the prevention of asthma. The benefits of breathing are also received in this posture. It will be easy to feel the strain in the intestines, which will increase the intestinal activity and remove constipation. In this posture, the shape of the body becomes like a fish, hence it is called matsyasana. This asana is able to widen the chest and keep it healthy. Caution! Do not posture this in the event of severe pain in the chest and throat or any other disease. It should be done with great caution. There is a fear of spontaneity in the neck because the torso has to be fixed at all. This seat can be done from 1 minute to 2 minutes. Its benefits. This increases the eyesight of the eyes. The throat remains clean and the chest and stomach diseases are removed. The speed of blood circulation increases, there is no skin disease. Asthma patients get benefit from this. Stomach fat decreases. Coughing is away. Vajra means harsh and secondly that the name of one weapon of Indra was Vajra. It has strong thighs of the legs. The blood circulation increases in the body. It is very beneficial for digestion. After this meal should sit for some time in this posture. It also strengthens the leg muscles. Do not do this posture in case of knee pain. Caution! Do not do this posture in case of knee pain. Its benefits. This posture makes the body strong and stable. This leads to spinal cord and shoulders straight. This leads to blood circulation in the body and thus the disease of transferring vein blood to arterial blood is not possible. This is the only such asana which you can do even by eating food. This makes food easily digested. It also strengthens the leg muscles, keeps the body tidy, high blood pressure is low, help in losing weight, disorders of indigestion, gas, constipation, etc. In women, irregularity of menstrual cycle is eliminated. The spinal cord is strong, enhances digestion and empowers the reproductive system. In this posture, slowly and deep breathing, the lungs are strong.